This is Sir Tap Tap. Let me tell you of a time long ago when I fell in love with the majesty of colors. This is actually a game I played a long time ago. Last night I had a dream. I floated in darkness, immense, squamous. My mind flowed like my body, slowly and sinuously. Tremendous wheels, both too slow and too fast to be described to you now. I was perfect, titanic, and serene. But then, just as I moved through the cold abyss, I saw a light. And I came near and I saw something wonderful. Something baloney. Above me, there was an alien world. Strange orbs floated there. And there was something special about them, something I'd never seen before. I fell in love with the majesty of colors. By the way, I'm a giant tentacle monster. The strange noise, a creature approached, riding on a colorful mount. I knew this creature was responsible for the beauty I had seen, and I wanted to learn more about it. Hi, little guy. I felt the creature writhing as I touched it. Disgust and fear welled up with me. What should I do? Should I let it go? I should. As the creature fled, I wondered if I had done the wise thing, allowing it to escape with knowledge of me. Bird. I can't eat the bird. Another vessel approached. These creatures appeared to be trying to gather fish, but the tools were woefully inadequate compared to my deft, sinuous reach. Have a fish, good sir. The creature peered into the water as they left, their vessels full of fish. One of them raised a fleshy fin. Was it a threat? Was it a mistake to help them? It's plain. Love, Tentacle. Tentacle loves you, too. In an incredibly inappropriate way. Oh, I just love all of those orifices you humans have. There's so many of them. From the land nearby, a tiny figure drifted out. It looked like a small version of the creatures, alone, struggling to stay afloat. Here you go, little guy. I'll put you... Parker, get down! A shark approached the open sea, its cold eyes focused on the child. There was no way the creature could survive without help. Let's suffocate the shark, then. Bloop. Can I eat it? Can I eat the shark? Far above the water, a form appeared, slowly approaching the child. Surely this was another crea creation of the creatures. Come to the child's aid. There you go, kid. Kid! Hey! Ass butt! Come get the fucking... You're a douche. I'm trying to help you with this kid here. Fucking sharks. And you're just like, yeah, I don't want to go to the tentacle that's trying to help me. You know, there was a guy with, you know, a freaking banner that was all like, love tentacle. So you should love tentacle too, because tentacle loves you. Intimately. In your orifices. It's just... It's the special kind of love. It really is. There you go, sharks. Can I eat that? No. As the noisy thing swam through the air, burying the child, I felt an odd affection familiarity for these bizarre creatures. My vision blurred and I woke up in my bed, the sheets damp with sweat. In the distance, I could hear a helicopter flying slowly to its destination. We got the good ending! This game has five endings. Last night I had a dream. It was pretty much the same dream. Grab this thing, blah, throw it away. Stupid balloons. Wowie, 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 wowie. All right, get on with it. Let's find that human. Human? Hello, human. Come here. I would like to take a look at you. Hmm. I think I broke it. The creature became limp. The struggle ceased. Would the other creatures find out? Had I chosen wisely? Wowie, 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 wowie. How did you even know? How did you... You know what? 
No tentacle love for you, good sir. Just, your orifices are just gonna be free of tentacles. Because, you know, you, you, sir, are a jerk. The new vessel arrived, this one occupied by strange spheres that made painful noises. The creatures were angry. Let me grab one of these. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. You want to see something funny? <laughs> A strange fish approached through the water. Was this one of the creature's creations? Would I survive this new foe? Hey! Ha! <laughs> hey! Whoa! Ha! <laughs> Punks. A strange device sent by the air-breathing creature shattered, spilling bodies and bubbles into the cold ocean. Suddenly, I found myself awake in my bed. In the distance, a strange howl echoed and faded away. Yep, we're the bad guy. Colors! I love colors! 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 Colors. Sure. I really love how the tentacle moves, like, follows your mouse. It's really cool and sinewy how it does it. Hey, buddy! Hey, hey! I'm gonna drown ya. Gonna drown ya. Gonna drown- Oh! You're okay. Gonna drown ya! Ha ha ha! Hi! Hey, buddy. Oh, you're alive. Oh, you're dead. Oh, alive. A dead. Up, oh, dip, dip, up, 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 Blunk. Ha! Here's your boat back. Now, no, I'll, 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 I'll put you back in your boat, I guess. <laughs> Demons. This creature fled, blah, blah. I'm, I'm gonna look at this. Look at this. I really like this game, by the way. I, I played it a long time ago, so I'm not really surprised, but, uh... Hey, buddy. Come here. Bloop! And... I have a balloon. Would you like a balloon, sir? Would you like a balloon? Bloop! Yeah, I love the, um... It's just a very interesting whole little thing. Wait, no. I meant to kill you. No, have a fish, though. Have a fish. Have another fish. Drown. I love the multiple endings and the whole... The choices. And being a freaking giant tentacle monster. Like, I would not have expected that. I held the, the hunting creature below the waves until it died. I did give them some fish, though, so it's kind of... If this were a Fallout game, I would have even karma for that, because I gave them fish. I'm not death. Let me hug you with my tentacle glee. Let me show you what I can do with those human orifices with my tentacle. Oh, yes. You know you want it. I'm a sassy tentacle monster who don't need no man. New vessel arrived. Painful spheres. You know what? Give me one of those. Give me that, sir. Sir. Thank you. Ow. Let's take that one too. Precious eyes! I didn't need them anyway. The fear of the creatures at my, at my murder of one of their own proved too strong. The explosions racked my body and my maimed eyes oozed sickly sweet itcher into the oceans my vision dimmed. Pain filled my existence. I woke up in bed, held up my eyes to my face, discovered my palms scored with bleaching, bleeding scratches. I like that one. It's like, it's pretty screwed up. Like, everything he does, like, happens in a way in real life. So there, he's like, yeah, clawed himself up pretty good. Um, let's see what happens if we don't save the baby. I forget the other two endings, honestly. Baby! Get in my belly! 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 Woo! Woo! There you go. <laughs> Have a balloon! Would you like a balloon? Balloon! 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 Would you like a balloon? Boat? Fish boat? Fish boat? Would you like a balloon? No, you just want fish. Have a fish. Have a 
fish. Have a fish. Just have that one. Oh, by the way, I'm gonna steal you out of your boat. Fish. Will he leave without his buddy if I give him all the fish? No, I, I'll, I'll leave back. There you go. Was it a mistake to help them? Balloon! A silver balloon! You can keep the balloons if you, um, they slowly float away. But you can keep them if you keep, you know, pushing them back. Tentacle love! Love, tentacle! Love! 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 Hey, little baby! Whoop! Sorry, baby. Feed you to the drift shark. The flurry of fins and teeth took just a moment, leaving barely a drop of blood behind to mark the child's passing. The young creature was dead, and I couldn't help but to think I could have prevented it. By drowning it! The world spun, and I woke up my bed, my nose bleeding and the taste of rust in my mouth. I just ate a baby! Alright, let's take a peek at the last ending here. Yeah, yeah. Majesty of Colors! Colors! I like colors! I fucking love coloring! Oh yeah, and the color of the balloons is randomly... You know, there's only a few different kinds of balloons, but they're randomly picked. Let's keep all of them on screen. Oh no! We already... No! No, human! Human, no! Oh. I can't grab that balloon, so I'll grab your fleshy corpse. Just swing you around in there. I'll give a balloon to your corpse, though. Balloons. I shall keep them. They are my balloons. Yes. I shall tend to them well. If the last ending you need to tick off the humans, why can't I get this <coughs> grab this guy and eat him? Be like, oh no 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 no. Death tentacle Death te Death Tentacle Death 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 Give me one of those. Oh, I'll just drown you. Drown. Drown. Oh! I'm not dexterous enough to dodge these torpedoes! I'll just... My eye! Oh no! I fought back against the creatures, <coughs> but the strange powers proved too much for me. My body was torn apart by strange devices, the color slowly fading from my ruined eyes. My mind was consumed by agony, and I suddenly sat straight up in my bed, awake. I lifted my hand to my ear to drop it, find a drop of crimson blood. My brain hurts! Well, that was... I fell in love with the majesty of colors. The death endings are sort of, like... I wouldn't have expected there to be two different death endings, but I guess it kind of makes sense, because there's two different sort of attacks. But... <laughs> I really like that game. Um, it's a very interesting sort of, like, it's very surreal and, you know, um, I really love how the tentacle moves around when you move your mouse. It's a very lifelike. But, yeah, that was I Fell in Love with the Majesty of Colors, and excuse me while I wipe all of this blood from my hands and ears.